Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to learn how to multiply fractions. So before you watch this video, give me a big thumbs up, subscribe, and click that bell button below. So let's start. Let's have one example. Let's have our example number one. One third multiplied by three fourths. Okay, so let's start multiplying. So in order to multiply fractions, we are going to multiply numerator to numerator and denominator to denominator. So one times, okay, wait a minute. Okay, so one times three is three and three times four is 12. Okay, so since 3 is a factor of 12, we have to change the fraction to the lowest terms. So in order to do that, we will we will divide both the numerator and denominator by their greatest common factor or GCF, which is 3. So 3 divided by 3 and 12 divided by 3. Okay, so now we will divide. So 3, by the, so three divided by 3 is 1. And then 12 divided by 3 is 4. So our final answer for this example is 1 fourth. Okay, let's go to our next you let's go to our next example. Okay, so let's have okay, wait a minute. Let's have 2 third multiplied by um let's have 6 8. 6 and then 8 okay okay so again we are going to multiply numerator to numerator and denominator to denominator okay so so 2 times 6 is 12 and 3 times 8 is what was that oh yeah 24 Again, let's change this fraction, our answer here, into a, into the lowest terms. Now, we will divide both the numerator and denominator by the GCF, which is 12. 12 divided by 12, and 24 divided by 12. Okay, so, so now we are going to divide. So 12 divided by 12 is 1, and 24 divided by 12 is 2. So our final answer for this example is 1 half. Yay! Okay, so let's go to our next example here. Okay, so let's have 3, 1 half, multiplied by 2. Okay, so since this so since this is a mixed number we have here, we are going to convert this mixed number into an improper fraction. So in order to convert it into an improper to in, into an improper fraction, we are going to multiply and plus. Okay, so two times three is six and plus one, so it's seven. And then we are going to copy our denominator, which is 2. And then our multiplication sign. So since this is a whole number we have here, we are going to use 1 as our denominator because um, it's just the way things are. Um, even though this number is like 6, 8, 4, 3, even though it's 1 or 100, our denominator will always be 1. Okay, so now we are going to multiply. So 7 times 2 is 14. And 2 times 1 is 2. Okay, so since this is an improper fraction, we are going to divide. So... We are going to put 14 on the inside of this sign and 2 on the outside. 
Okay, so now we are going to divide. So 14 divided by 2 is 7. And 7 times 2 is 14. Okay, so 14 minus 14 is 0. So since our answer here at the bottom is 0 here, we are going to use our um, answer here at the top, the number 7, as our final whole number answer. There. So this is our final answer for this example. Okay, let's have another one. Okay, so let's try 338. Okay, wait a minute. Three, three, eight, multiplied by, okay, that's three, three, eight. So we have, so we are going to multiply it by two, two, third. Okay, so since these two fractions are both, um, both mixed numbers, we are going to convert these two mixed numbers into an improper fraction okay so in order to do that again is multiply and plus multiply and plus okay so 3 times 8 is 24 so 24 plus 3 is 27 we're gonna have 27 we are going to copy our denominator 8 and then we're going to multiply. Okay, so 2 times 3, or 3 times 2, is 6. So plus 2, so it's 8. Okay, 8 here. Copy our denominator. Okay, and again, now we are going to multiply. So we're going to apply our cancellation method. 1. And what? Okay, so 27 my times 1 is 27. And 1 times 3 is 3. Okay, so again, this is an improper fraction we have here. Now, we are going to divide. Just like the, just like the same thing we did a few minutes ago. Yeah. Okay, so now we are going to divide. So 27 divided by 3 is um nine nine so nine times three is 27 and then we are going to subtract so 27 minus 27 is zero so again our answer here at the bottom is zero so now we are going to use our answer here at the top which is nine number nine we are going to use it as our whole number Answer. Okay, so let's have another example. Okay, let's cut this one. And then we are going to multiply. We're going to multiply fractions again. So let's have. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm really sorry about that. Okay, so let's have five. Five, um, one fourth, one fourth multiplied by ten. Okay, so again, so now we are going to convert our mixed number into an improper fraction. Okay, so four, five times four is twenty, so plus one, so it's twenty one. And then we are going to copy our, um, what's that called again? Oh yeah, our um, denominator. And then, so the last time we used one as our, as our denominator. So again, we are going to do the same thing. Remember what I said? That, that even though, even though up to 100, our whole number here is 100 we are still going to use one as our as our denominator okay so now we will multiply 
let's let's choose color blue okay so 21 times 10 okay so i think it's um 21 times 10 is wait a minute guys okay wait a minute um wait a minute as on our numerator so let so let's go back to our discussion so 210 okay 210 divided by 4 <gasps> sorry about this sign now okay so 210 divided by 4, four i think it's yeah, 52 yeah that's 52 okay okay so 52 times 52 times 4 is 208 okay so 210 minus 208 is 2 okay so we'll use our example our answer here at the top which is 52 as our whole number and our our answer here at our answer here our answer here at the bottom number two as our numerator and our and the uh, number that we used earlier to divide to divide which is number four yeah the one that we used earlier we are going to use it as our denominator so that's the last example so thank you guys for watching this video and please subscribe like and hit that not and hit that bell button below so bye guys and god bless to care with your family and love always love always bye guys